Greetings Kaiju collectors and Kaiju fans. It is Thomas here and today we have a big unboxing and what we have here is the X Plus Gigantic King Kong from the Godzilla vs King Kong film from 2021 and this is I would say one of the most highly anticipated releases from X Plus that I've been waiting for and it just came this afternoon so I'm going to quickly unbox this and and see how it looks. Now I did see some earlier pictures of somebody having this or receiving this yesterday and it looked really good. And I think also someone else got one today too. So there's been a couple in the Kaiju groups that has shared their pictures and it looks pretty good. I did notice a couple of things about it though is that Folks are saying that it is a little bit out of scale. So it's a little bit bigger than he should be from the film, which is, I find that kind of baffling because you would think they have all this technology and computer programming and all and the 3D imaging that they can go ahead and take care of that. But, you know, I'm gonna expedite this. I'm not gonna show every step of this, but I, I do want you guys to see the box, the box art. I'm sorry, this room is just too small. But that's, that's how Kong looks. It looks like he's about to uh, beat on his chest, I guess. It's uh, definitely an animated dynamic pose. So at this point, I'm going to pause and I'm going to open up this box so we can get right to it. All right, my friends, I went ahead and got the inner box out so we can save a little bit of time. But I do want to experience the actual unboxing of the inner part. So let's... Okay, this is pretty exciting. Ooh, so anything that's Kong related is pretty exciting because there isn't that many Kong stuff. That is awesome. It is one piece, one solid piece. He is face down. Ooh, even even though he's wrapped in plastic, he has a very strong, fresh vinyl smell. And as you could say, uh, as as Rich Iso would say, ah, that is an awesome smell. Actually, I'm not sure what he says, but he says something. Ah, I think he just says fresh vinyl. Okay, so let's get Kong out. Ooh, that's that's pretty sweet. It is in one piece. Hey, he's holding us. Hey, they got a little bubble wrap so i guess he doesn't there you go Ooh. so there you have it the 2021 king kong wow Ooh, it's, it's pretty gorgeous and what's cool he, he's pretty stable too check that out man he's got this he looks very looks really buff looks extremely strong he got some serious back muscles and I remember in the early promotional pictures, there was, I think he had a double fang on each side and they said that was not screen, screen accurate. So they must have heard or they, they spotted that mistake and they fixed it. So it's single, single canines on the top and on the bottom. And first impression, he, he looks great. And it was noted that he's a little bit stylicized and I do agree he, he is. But but he looks he looks he looks great. I was concerned that he would not have great details, but he has a wonderful scope. And fortunately for me, I'm not as particular as far as it being you know hundred percent screen accurate. I know some of the gigantics they do stylicize it, and I know it drives some folks insane. But I'm just so glad that we have a gigantic Kong. Oh, there's a little bit of styrofoam. That's okay. So. You know what? I think the best thing to do is get some get some close up so you guys can appreciate it. He uh, he's a beast. I can't believe we have a Kong. All right, let's go ahead and get some close ups.
All right, let's get to our first comparison. And we have the Godzilla 1973, and that's the Tengetsu uh, resin model kit figure. And those guys scale pretty good, I think. Kong's a little bit shorter, so that's about right, I think. And that Godzilla is supposed to be the 50, the 50 centimeter uh, in size. For comparison number two, just for kicks, we have the X plus 25 centimeter. I think that's the 1999, 2000 Godzilla. And that's the Rick version with the interchangeable mouth and, and the, uh, the ship. And for our next comparison, we have a 1954 Godzilla. And this is the, I believe this is the Paradise, the Paradise kit. And what's funny is that I thought this Paradise kit would look pretty much exactly what the X Plus FSL 54 would be because it's based on that kit. But apparently they made some differences. So that's, like I said, that's pretty interesting. For our fourth comparison, we have the awesome X Plus 2019 Rick Godzilla. And from right here, it looks like they scale pretty well. So on, on closer inspection here, I can see that Kong is actually a little bit taller than Godzilla. And I believe that's inaccurate. And here's another angle. And you guys can see the scale between the two. And if I put them this way, it looks like Kong is about the right scale, but this is just forced perspective. So that's not actually accurate. Okay, I don't, I don't think Kong cares that, that, he's, that he's out of scale. He's having too much fun here. All right, and I'm back. So I hope you guys like my super fast quick review on this 2021 uh, x plus gigantic kong uh, my first impression is that i think he's he looks really good you know you guys will have to kind of either accept that it's slightly stylicized for hopefully for maximum satisfaction but even not i mean it it looks great now i did notice there's a little there's like a little 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 like a almost like a little hole there but it's not I wonder what that is. Maybe that's just the small of his back. That's what I'm thinking. And hey, one more bonus comparison is the Skull Island Kong here from Star Ace. And you know, if you look at the dimensions, it's kind of similar. You know, it's it's he's a little bit slimmer. He's very muscular. So I think they did a pretty good job. Somebody was saying that Kong's head was too small. I it looks about right to me. Maybe, maybe I'm mistaken, but he looks really good to me. And I think X, X Plus did a good job. Like I said earlier, I was concerned that maybe that the details will be pretty, pretty bland. Cause the, the earlier images, it, you know, it looked, it looked a little bland, but def, but definitely they, there is definitely enough, enough details on this, on this huge Kong here. Overall it looks, it looks good. I mean, I'm, I'm just pretty, I'm just darn excited that we have one and I don't, you know what? I didn't film the inner part of his mouth, but there is just this. It, it's painted really good. You, each indi each individual tooth is painted. It looks it looks really great. This it's pretty gnarly. Now this this stance is like he's like looking up. He's kind of looking up, so you'll have to angle the camera down to see his eyes, because then you'll just see like his like his jaw. So that's like I guess he's kind of maybe 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 he's looking at an airplane. I'm not sure. Or he's in the, the you know he's uh, pounding his chest in defiance, so that is pretty cool. So as far as a basic score on this Kong, I, I give it I give it a very high score, and you know you know I'm still I'm still checking him out, so I'm a little bit 
what you call it, I'm a little biased just, just by the excitement of it all. And I'm sure you guys noticed that he has those three scratches on his chest. He is, uh, that's, yeah, he looks, he looks great. Man, I, I, I hope you guys really enjoy this figure. Because I know, I know some of you guys ordered and perhaps some of you guys may have passed. But I was no way gonna, gonna miss this Kong. He, he, he's, he's sweet. So that is it guys, that's my quick review. You, you guys can, hopefully you guys can pick out a little bit what you saw in the video and you guys can make your own determination if he is, if he is super awesome to you or not. I think, I think he's, he's great. So that, that concludes my really quick review. Please feel free to uh, comment. You know, I'm gonna be look, checking him out some more during the course of this evening, but I wanted to get this review out as soon as possible so you guys can see this awesome Kong. So, Thanks again for watching my review. Please consider subscribing and we'll, we'll get some more videos out soon. I got a couple more lined up. So you guys take care and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.